Start right now. Start Android.com sitting here with the Sony Ericsson Xperia Lay. Um, I'm with Christoph. Uh, Christoph from Sony Ericsson. He's going to show us the device, uh, take us to a quick demo. We're starting off with a game here. Which, which game is this? This is Bruce Lee. It's okay. a street fighting game and it really brings out the idea of having hard keys. So you, you, you feel what you're doing. Uh, this is a little fight I'm taking here with the master. Mm -hmm. Let's kick it out and uh, load up. Just a second, please. And, um, and getting ready for a little fight. Stop. So, there are a lot of moves and actually, if I don't train it, I will never win. It's really, really difficult, actually. So... <laughs> it looks like you're just button mashing. I know, I know. This is <laughs> you gotta learn those oh, combos. You need to learn. Yeah, I have I have a few of those, but what kind of a GPU is powering this this, this phone? GPU. Yeah. Graphic processor. Yeah, yeah. It's, uh, Atno, Adeno. Two hundred five. Uh, Two hundred five. Yeah. Oh, nice. nice. And it's it's optimized for gaming, so we did a lot of extra work. And is this is this a one gigahertz Snapdragon? Yes. The, the new MSM. That's right. Okay. And uh, I won. After all. <laughs> <laughs> nice. yeah. Is it is that the is this game like coming pre-installed on the device? Or? Yes, it does. Okay, how many other games come pre-installed? That depends on the country, actually. But okay. overall, maybe three, four. And we really want to show what it can do out of the box, so people will not be disappointed and see what right. they can do and get more of those. Right. So, how many games uh, do you think will be available at launch, optimized for the Xperia Play? Uh, at launch, I think we have about fifty in, in, in the scope. And how many different uh, how many different uh, publishers? How many is, is I, I don't know the numbers, maybe you need to get that right, but it's 10 or 20, it's okay. quite a lot of good support we are getting. So let's get out of this thing. Alright, so is this using the same Bravia engine display that the Arc and the other phones are using? Uh, no, it doesn't use the Bravia engine. The Bravia engine, uh, we have optimized for the gameplay, so okay. it, it's uh, quick. The Bravia engine helps you for video watching right, but photos. When yeah. you do that though, will, it, will, it, will that come into play on this one? Uh, not on this one, no. Okay. We, we, we put all the graphic power to make only the games. Okay, so what about the camera? Is the camera the same quality as the Arc? Or uh, that... No, this is a 5 megapixel, okay. but it makes excellent pictures. Okay. So we, we choose a little lower one to make the, the build smaller and uh, put a focus. We have maybe one more game for you and then... Okay. See, what I mean, is this? It's still a phone. And, and right, right, right. You, you have this, to remember this is not really trying to additional in your pocket. This right. is what you have all the time. And then it's a uh, it split and open and becomes your game device. Yeah, exactly. Is this, this going to be, um, is, it, is PlayStation Suite going to be out by the time this phone comes out? PlayStation, PlayStation Suite? Suite? Uh, PlayStation Suite, you have to talk to Sony actually because they are managing that. And it comes okay. a bit later as far as I know. Okay. But we are working with them to bring it out as soon as possible. And okay, so you're showing us FIFA on the Xperia Player, right? Yeah, and FIFA, FIFA is a fantastic game and it uses all the analog controls. Right, I think I heard about this game coming out earlier. I, didn't, I have never actually seen it in motion. Okay, though. let's have a quick look on this uh, here. You see, I'm the character with the ball here, right. and I can walk around analog any direction. Mm -hmm. I can kick. Yeah, now I'm here. I have to run. So, and uh, actually, and pretty close to my goal in enough seconds. <laughs> This is just as uh, realistic yeah. as like the console version. And stuff, and right? you can play multiplayer. You can play right. against other people. Can you do that over Wi-Fi, or is that just like a close function? Okay. Um, um, yeah, you see, the, you can make them run and uh, a lot of tricks, but I haven't figured them out all yet. <laughs> And it, this is a lot of fun because you, you choose your team and uh, play against your friend. And right. So are those analog sticks, are those like touch sensitive? Or? Touch sensitive and very, very easy to, to move. We, we put a it sensitive uh, surface, you know, the center, you know, the, the, the surrounding. Right. So it's a lot better than on, on a screen. Right, yeah, and yeah. you don't even you know what your thumb's covering smear the screen your screens. Exactly. So and that thing is accurate? Like you don't 
don't you don't need to worry about you know it ever. It is really accurate in the, in the technology. It's depending on the game developer to use the accuracy or not. So okay. in some games it works really well, and in some it works okay. But in any case, often you can use those as an alternative if you don't feel that it's good enough. Okay. Um. So how many? How open is this for like other developers who aren't you know directly partnering with you guys? Uh, we really want to make it uh, available to as many as possible. Okay. So. I don't know the latest on how we work with uh, Android, maybe a plugin or some way. Right. Or an SDK or anything like that? Absolutely. I'm trying to get this. So I, I think uh, maybe if you want to chat on the developer support, there are some guys who know all the details on okay. the floor. Okay, I'll ask you about that. Okay. Um, and then what else does this have besides the gaming? Like what, what other kind of features? And yeah, let's have a look at that. Um, at least what's different from like the Xperia Arc and all that stuff. Uh, different from Xperia Arc. Um, I mean, this has everything optimized on gaming and still keeping all the key features from the phone. So right. it doesn't try to... So it doesn't try better, to change too much. It better, to exactly. It tries to add something. So we're not saying it's better right. than Xperia Arc and something else. Um, but you have everything else. So you, have, you look at the home screen, a simple flick, and you've got all your widgets together and go out and again. you can drop the uh, different apps on to another app and it becomes a folder. You, uh, you've seen that, right? Yeah. Uh, make folders, customize whatever you want, game folder, go and put your stuff in if you want to. It's super simple and re uh, very responsive. And this is Android 2.3, right? Yes, it's the gingerbread. So the latest uh, smartphone you can get, basically. Cool. That is the Sony Ericsson Xperia Play from Sony Ericsson, uh, shown off here at Mobile World Congress in Barcelona. Put it from Android.com signing off. Thank you so much, Chris. Thank you.